everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be going to doing bad sentences as well as this toot for girl. I haven't done a girl in a while. Well, I don't do that many girls, but I believe the girl video went up the other day, so I don't know. But, toot for a girl fantasy themed box. It's been really fun. This is one of my favorite concept ideas that we have done. I really recommend you doing it. And if you are looking for a theme, it's pretty easy. You just see something mythical and you throw it in and it's super cute. And also, she has a lot of pencils and stuff. So, you know. Anyways, let's just jump into the video. Okay, so let's start out with toys. So first we have, this is a purple horse. And then we have a pink unicorn. A purple alicorn. And then a pink alicorn. And we got these in a pack thing. The Dollar Tree that came together, really cool. We got this alien dude, whose aliens are mythical. And we got that in a party pack off of Amazon. We have this crown ring. I assume it came in off that party pack off of Amazon. I don't know. I probably should have put this with wearables. Then we have this Batman whistle. We got these weird monster looking dude finger puppet things. We have a fantasy memory. I'm curious about what the cards will look like. So one second. There are the cards. And just so you know. Narwhals are real creatures. Those are what they look like. They're pretty darn cute. And we got this off of... We got this at Target in a party pack. In like a bunch of different cards. Then we have this... Uh, Stuffy the Dinosaur. He's pretty cute. We got in some place. We have these unicorn launcher dude, and I believe it's from the Dollar Tree. Then we have this unicorn magic wand, which is just so cute. This beach ball, which is like the only toy in here that doesn't have mythical reasoning behind it. And then this unicorn plush from the Dollar Tree, he's like so ugly, he's cute kind of deal. And he's so fun to hold just like this. I don't know why, but I love it. A transition between school supplies and toys. We have like arts and crafts. We have this bead making kit. And I hope this girl loves to color because she got some coloring stuff. So she has this jumbo My Little Pony coloring book. She has this a dinosaur, not dinosaur, dragon like face put her on her this mer creature coloring book which is like under the sea with mermaids thrown in which is pretty fun and it comes with stickers and then an onward uh grab and go thingy for bobber the dirter what does for dirter mean i do not know and then for school supplies we have this mermaid notebook from the Dollar Tree. It has plain paper in it. We have two of these notebooks. And so many people have sent them to us. And I just appreciate it so much. Thank you so much to everyone who sent me these notebooks. Who sent me anything really. I just appreciate it so very much. And then we have this little alien dude notebook. It's just plain paper. We got this in a party pack at Walmart. We have some pink scissors. We got in a pack from, I believe, my Aunt Pam. Thank you so much, Aunt Pam. You are amazing. And, yeah, they're pretty cool. And then we have these bookmarkers that we had. And this one is a catacorn, or whatever it's called, catahorn. But it's pretty dang cute, and he has a rainbow tail. So 
Okay, so book mark that thing we had around and I never used. So we put it in there. The pencil just stabs me. And then we have a pencil sharpener. And it's red and we got it in the pack off from the Amazon. And then we have so many fun things. We have these markers we got for this kit thing in this kit thing at Party City and then we split it up for some reason. Probably because the box already had markers. And we figured the markers from this and then the crayons from the onward pack would be enough coloring supplies. But yeah, we wouldn't need to put in another thing. And then we have these ballpoint pens from my Aunt Diana. Thank you so much, Aunt Diana. These were so amazing. We already used them all up. And it's just crazy. And I appreciate it so much. And then we got some pencil. Someone donated to us. I'm not sure who. But thank you to whoever did. You are amazing. And I appreciate you so much. And then we have these fun ones, which are from the Dollar Tree. And then we have these mermaid ones that my Grammy donated. And I just appreciate it so much. These are super cute and super nice. And Grammy, you are amazing. And then we have this all colored pen donated, I believe, from my Aunt Pam. And as you know, Aunt Pam is amazing. And then uh, let's uh, do necessities. So first we have this super cute mermaid bag that my Grammy donated. She is amazing, she is awesome, and the best. I love her so dang much. And then we have this four year old white washcloth from the Dollar Tree. That came in a pack of four, so 25 cents per washcloth. That's a great deal, if I do say so myself. Then we have these spoons and forks we got from Target for $6 in a pack. Then we have this little sewing kit that Christina donated. Thank you so much, Christina. This is such a great thing really for any of the ages and I really appreciate it. You are amazing. Then we have this brush from Amazon, do need it from, I'm thinking it's either Kathy or Aunt Amanda. If you ever did, you are amazing and you should know that. Then we have this soap and a soap container. This soap container is so nice. It's like the nicest soap container I've ever seen from Amazon. And my Aunt Amanda donated it. And I just gotta say, thank you so much Aunt Amanda. You are amazing. And then we have this My Little Pony toothbrush in the hands. Uh, two pieces is in an alicorn. Super cute. And then for wearables, which is our last category, we have a crown. We got these off of Oriental Trading in a pack. And I gotta say, you should really, they, kids really like when you put things on that they can like stick on their head. They just think it's so fun. And that's what I heard from people who go out when they're get in the boxes. And crowns just make little girls feel like princesses and I just think it's amazing. We should totally put stuff like that in. Then we have two bracelets. I feel like these are from the Dollar Tree. I don't know where we got them though, but they're really cute and they have little unicorns or alicorns on them. And then we have this a blue headband and a purple headband and a green bow and there's one more hair thing some little clips and then the headbands are from the dollar gen not the dollar gen the 99 cent store i don't know where we got the bow and the clips are from the dollar tree and they're all pretty dang nice and then we have some pairs of white socks and these are technically boy socks Shh, don't tell anyone it's a secret and then but like we didn't have any girl socks and they're just plain old white socks so 
doesn't matter. And then we have these bracelets from, I want to say the Dollar Tree, so I'm going to say that. But I don't know. My mom got them. And then we have two pairs of size 6 underwear. And that is from the, the 99 cent store. I got it in a pack. And then these super cute unicorn flip-flops from the Dollar Tree. Oh my goodness, they are adorable. And then last but not least, we have this long sleeved, really cute pink striped four teeth shirt that we got from Target. Okay, so thank you so much for watching this video. And I'm curious, are you over this outro yet? Because I'm using it for a while. Anyways, don't forget about the GoFundMe and the Amazon wish list link down below. It'd be a great help in my goal for my 100 boxes. Or you could just subscribe and see tomorrow's video because I'm posting every day except for Sunday for the month of July to the first week of August. The first week of August is the last time I will be doing this. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you all. Come <laughs>